Right, so here we have the uh, URC um, 7100 touchscreen 7 inch control panel, which is obviously has wireless charging in the base there. Um, and uh, it's connected to uh, this, well, the system that's in the cabinet there, it's home um, center room, family room. And oh, yep, oh, there's the cat. And then here we have all the sources. So starting with the lights, for example, different scenes. So scene one, for example, that's what the lights are on at the moment now. And you know, scene three, not even seen that. Anyway, um, scene four, got even dimmer, go back to scene one. And lights off. Oops, anyway, let's go back to scene one. Close the lights, CCTV. Nintendo Wii, PlayStation, and entertainment. And within entertainment, we have all these options, Sky. I've got different um, um, icons for the different Sky boxes. You know, you've got uh, several Sky boxes here around the house. Um, Blu-ray, Smart TV, and we've got a backup Sky. So should all the rest stop working around the house, you've still got another backup Sky. We've got karaoke machine. So the main Sky in this room is that one there. And that will turn on the TV, and then we all should be presented with that particular sky source that's on there. There we go. And then we have also um, other feature functions included in that. There we go. Apple TV, of course, and the controls for the Apple TV will come up. That's it there. And then obviously we have the, the menu up, down, left, right, all that sort of, all that good stuff that's um, on there. Then of course we have all of the, if you want to view the sky from the master bedroom, you can view that, um, etc. You've got some additional settings on there, which is quite cool. You can have the weather displayed like that. Um, dim it for nighttime. You can have it like that. Oops, I double tap that. And you can have, um, let's have a look, see the settings, proximity sensor. So when you come close to it, it will actually come on. You can choose the sensor level on there, how, sensor, how sensitive it is. Set alarm clock for the time of the day. Um, intercom, you have the intercom so you can talk throughout. So I can enable the intercom. So between, enable audio video. Yep, that's good to go. Um, you can set it a name as well for that particular room here. I just put in the room to say what it is. So let's say this is a TV room. I want to pause you for all of that. Okay, so that's listed as TV room. Um, enter that. That's done. TV room there. Um, enable intercom video. Okay, enable that. Not baby monitor. Um, then you can have set notification sound we don't need to do that so now that means that how you can if i come out of that drop that down that's the intercom and then i can ch choose which room you see it just says intercom there currently but i can choose which room and disable that etc that's quite cool so finish that close that from there and um, if you want to switch everything off just press that button there and that will turn everything off. And if I go to another room, which is the kitchen, here, and I go to this one here, as you see, that's come to light as soon as I've come close to it. Um, if I drop that down and I press the intercom, you see it says TV room there because that's the name I gave it. And I can, um, you know, select that or the TV room name, this one here. Click call. And go into the other room. You see? See, from intercom. But I've not given it another name yet. So I've just labeled this one, given it a name, which is a kitchen. So if I go down and I select intercom and I select uh, TV room and I select call, since so it's calling TV room, so now when I go to the TV room, it should say kitchen calling. 
incoming call from kitchen. And I can answer ignore. Ignore it. I don't want that. Call is ended. And um, you can actually use your phone, mobile phone as well, Android, or the other device, etc. So that's cool. I'm just going to go to another one now and name that one. Right, so let's go up to this other one here, which is here. As you can see, dimly lit, but it's showing the time where I've just come to it and it's switched on. So what I do, drop this one down, select there, and then um, that's all cool. Let's give this one a name now. Um, go to settings. It should come up in a few seconds. Go to intercom and give it a name. So we call this um, master bedroom. Master. Shift B. Master bed. That's sufficient. With the letter that's there. Enter. And that is it. Exit from that there.